Hi guys. I'm not feeling good today. My throat is really sore. It feels really scratchy. So I'm going to try to limit my talking as much as possible, which is going to be really hard since I'm daily vlogging. Uh, I don't have any plans today during the day. Pete is currently at work and when he gets off work, we want to take Shorty to Petco to get her nails trimmed. I, I'm going to have them do it because I don't trust myself cutting dog's nails. I'm a afraid I'm gonna hurt her so we're gonna do that much later uh, right now I'm drinking my coffee and uh, I've been answering some email I got a conversation on Etsy potential sale hopefully fingers crossed waiting to hear back from them I've had two other sales so far this morning both for the Harry Potter inspired scarves so that's what I'm gonna spend my day doing is just crocheting that way I could just kick back and relax and not have to worry about doing a whole lot of anything I do have to do a little bit of housework because laundry's not gonna do itself the trash isn't gonna take itself out cat box won't clean itself Ugh, gross right I also need a vacuum I just don't want to do any of it I'm an adult right I can just say no they can wait till tomorrow but I can't do that because if I don't do it today, if I put it off tomorrow, then tomorrow I'll just have another excuse to put it off and just just do it, get it done. Ugh, yeah. Anyway, adulting it's hard sometimes. <laughs> I'm gonna quit talking, rest my voice, and go about my day. I just got back in from taking the trash out and as I was leaving I noticed something really weird outside my front door I have a bench and on my bench is a statue like one of those garden statues of a dog and then I have a welcome sign and a little watering can that's filled with just rocks nothing of great value is out there well I have the dog, the welcome sign, and the watering can sitting in the corner on the bench, usually. But when I opened up the door, they were not on the bench. Here, I'll show you guys. I didn't move them. So, look at this. This is really weird, and I don't know why anybody would do this. Yeah, when I opened up the door, they were sitting on the ground. Right here. Normally, they're right here in this corner. Who would do this, and why would they do this? I took a picture of everything as I showed you guys and I sent that picture to Pete and told him about it and he said that actually when he left for work this morning at 6 a.m. he saw everything on the ground but didn't think a whole lot of it it actually startled him a little bit you know the dog you know it took him a moment because he's tired and he's leaving and it's dark but um yeah he didn't think a whole lot of it because he was running late for work and then when I messaged him he was thinking well maybe that was one of the many things Shorty was barking at in the middle of the night because everything was fine when we went to bed I had it sitting where I always have it and then this morning it's on the ground that's strange so Pete thinks somebody might have been wanting to steal the bench and then Shorty barked and that scared them away it's hard to say I don't know I don't know why they'd want to steal the bench it's heavy it's nothing special it's something my dad made years and years ago so it you know it means something to me but at the same time it's replaceable you know it's not anything I'm attached to I'd be really bummed out if somebody stole it because I like it I like it there it holds my front decor and it's a great place to put our groceries as we're trying to get in the front door but ah it sucks I hate thieves or potential thieves it's just mind-boggling I mean what goes through your minds when uh, I'm frustrated I don't know what to do I, I'm just puzzled who does that I mean were they trying to steal something were they looking for something nothing's missing it's so weird 
I am so, so grateful I have a dog that barks. She barks at everything. Every little noise. So thank you, Shorty, for doing your job and being a dog that barks. I know it's annoying at times, but oh my gosh, I'm so grateful for her. <laughs> oh my. You want this? Yeah? Is this the one you want? Yeah. I think that's going to do it for today's video. I apologize that it's not fun and exciting. I just, with my throat feeling sore, I just didn't have a whole lot of energy to do much. Hopefully I feel better tomorrow so I can get a little more done. My plan, hopefully, is if I'm feeling better, I want to pull all my vending stuff down from upstairs and set up a table and figure out what I want to take and what I don't want to take for my next vending event, which is in November. So I want to plan ahead, and that way if I need to make things, I still have time. So hopefully we can do that tomorrow. I'll see you then. Have a good night, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye. Shorty, you want to say goodbye? Say goodbye. Uh, okay. Bye.